Hi, this is Mark Cunaberti, financial columnist for the Union and host of Money Matters on KVMR FM. And I'm here with the lovely Jen Ayala once more. Hello, everybody. So today we're going to be talking about World Qigong Tai Chi Day, which is going to be at the end of the month, April 28th. Um, right now we are over at 220 on Main Street in Nevada City at Vital Energy Arts, where we're going to be talking to Homer about this big event that we've got coming up. So I've taken martial arts probably since I was age 14. I think you've taken a lot of martial arts too, Since right? I was 11. Okay, well, there we go. I've been at it a little bit longer, maybe. <laughs> we're not going to go there. Anyway, we're going to go inside. It's going to It's going to be a global event, so we're going to check it out and let you know uh, what's going to be happening. Ready to go? Ready. Ready to go. So we're inside the Vital Energy Arts Studio in downtown Nevada City. I'm with Homer Nottingham. Homer... Could you tell us a little bit about what Tai Chi and Qigong is? Yeah, Qigong simply stands for Qi is energy in okay. the body and Gong is practice. So it's energy practice. Uh, it's a healthcare system and then Tai Chi is more of a martial arts system. It's about 2,000 years old. The healthcare system, Qigong is about 5,000 years old. Wow, so that's pretty old. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty um, old. I hear that we've got a big event coming up at the end of the month, a big World Tai Chi Qigong Festival. Yes, that's right. World Tai Chi and Qigong Day. And this is a, an event that's all the way around the world. Every city in the world will be doing it that day. It's one world, one breath. So mm -hmm. we're bringing the whole world together that day through Tai Chi and Qigong. It's sanctioned by the United Nations. It's sanctioned oh. by our county board of supervisors here. City of Grass Valley, um, uh, Mayor Howard Levine will be sanctioning it for the City of Grass Valley. So it's a worldwide event and we'll be doing it right here in Grass Valley. Okay, so please tell <laughs> us about what we're going to be doing in Grass Valley for this. Oh, it'll be a, it'll be a wonderful day. It'll, it'll be um, at, all day long from 9 to 12 in the morning. And in Grass Valley, we'll have the Taiko drummers, the Grass Valley Taiko drummers. We'll be doing Qigong to start the day. And then after the Taiko drummers, we'll have Alexis from Music in the Mountains and the Kiwanis Club uh, do a little peapod, a Chinese instrument, a couple of songs. And then the Taiko drummers will play. And then we'll have all the gyms in town, Body Balance, uh, Training Zone, Harmony Fitness Studio, and uh, South Yuba, of course. Mm -hmm. All the instructors will be there to demonstrate Tai Chi that we do, uh, different forms of Tai Chi. Very cool. So it's going to be um, on the 28th of April, which is a Saturday, yeah? That's correct. And it's gonna, we're going to be holding this at South Yuba Club, correct? South Yuba Club has donated the club the entire day that day. They're very generous. I want to thank Mike wow. and Phil for, for donating the gym that day. And the entire public can come. They do not need to be a member that day. They okay. can come and see the new gym. It's a world-class gym. And they can see the pools and the tennis and they can even do some of the events if they'd like that day or go in the pool and swim or go in the sauna. And uh, what time Mike, does it start? It starts at uh, 9 30 in the morning. Okay. Now we will have breakfast there. The Kiwanis Club is going to bring cool. all the food and drinks and <laughs> so we'll have all the beverages there and there'll be you know eggs and there'll be uh, rolls and anything that they want bagels and Nice. Uh, so there'll be a lot of food there so they can come early and, and enjoy a, a nice little breakfast with us, do some Tai Chi or Qigong, or just watch the demonstrations if they don't want to do it. It's mm -hmm. okay. It'll be a day of demonstrations and they're welcome to join in some of the demonstrations. As you know, Tai Chi and Qigong moves rather slowly so they can join right in with us and enjoy the day along with us. We'll also have the Kung Fu kids there from Body Balance and these are little girls about eight years old. Mm -hmm. And those little girls are the most confident girls that you'll ever meet. They can kick you right in the face and they have <laughs> no, no one bullies them. So they'll be there demonstrating that day. And then the high school kids will come with their swords to do swords, cool. sword Tai Chi. So it's going to be quite a demonstration. All right. So the 28th, which is a Saturday, April 28th. And it sounds like we're starting at 930 at South Yuba Club. You don't have to be a member. Public can come and just stop by, see Homer. And it sounds like we've got a lot of other really great lineups for this World Qigong Day. Bring all your friends, relatives, and neighbors and join us. <laughs>
Qigong Day at South Yuba Club on April 28th. We're going to be celebrating it at South Yuba Club. We're going to, it starts at 9.30, it goes till noon. We're going to have a lot of different demonstrations there, food, entertainment, music, Qigong, Tai Chi. You don't have to participate. You can just come and... Participate. I'm going to do it. <laughs> Mark's going to do it. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. You're going to do it? Homer's going to do it. We're all going to do it. We're all going to do it. <laughs> and that does it for another edition of Investing in Community, where we explore the amazing organization and events happening around us. If you want to send us an email, feel free to do so at moneymatters at kvmr.org. My name's Mark Cunaberti. I'm Jen Ayala. It's a lot of fun. We'll see everybody on the 28th. All the information will be at the end of this video. Say goodbye. Bye. Say goodbye. Bye. Bye. <laughs> nice job. Beautiful garden. It is beautiful. Lots of Buddhas too. <laughs>